Haunts. Well, next month, History in Haunts at Overholzer Mansion kicks off. And in studio this morning, Chantry Banks, Executive Director of Preservation Oklahoma Incorporated. Thanks so much. And Welcome to the show. Oh my gosh, thanks so much for having me. It is a thrill to be here this morning. Okay, so, so let's go ahead and get into okay. it. Talk about history and haunts. What can people expect this year? Okay, so just like every year, the exciting thing is uh, the mansions open in the evening. We give tours in the evening, which doesn't really happen throughout the year for us. It's also an opportunity uh, to interact with uh, some people who may still be living in the house, I Kylie. Love so I yeah. love that. Okay, <laughs> well, let's go ahead and ask it. Okay. Is Overholzer Mansion haunted? Is there are there some ghosts out there? Let's sell it. Let's get people going. Let me may, let me say this as a a skeptic. Okay. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the house I is, uh, I was in uh, working in the house last Friday, changing mm -hmm. some light bulbs, and I was on the second floor, and something was happening on the third floor, uh -oh. uh, and there was no one else in the house, and so I kept saying, hello, oh. hello, and uh, so yeah, th the house is very active, it's all friendly, we're talking Casper the Friendly Ghost type spirits, there we're we not go. talking anything malicious or evil Look, or scary. I so. love Casper, yes. and I'm sure Oklahomans, <laughs> and actually I know Oklahomans love those friendly ghosts out yes, there. Yes, absolutely. So let's talk about the dates and times, okay. and, and most importantly, tickets, because okay. I know this is a hot event. This is, we like to, well, I, I personally think we may be the hottest event in Oklahoma during the month of October, so <laughs> uh, tickets go on sale today at noon. So at noon, not not any minute, not a minute earlier, not a minute later. At <laughs> noon, uh, we have five dates in October: October seventh, fourteenth, and then we take a short break, and then the twenty seventh, twenty eighth, and 29th of October. It's from six to eight p.m. It's limited to thirty participants a night, so you are getting a really exciting uh, kind of up close and personal experience mm. at the mansion. Yeah, and we were talking about earlier. Not only do you get to find out, you know, about the those Casper the Friendly Ghosts yes. in the mansion, but you yes. also get to explore the mansion, see who lived there, learn the history of right. it. Talk a little bit more about exactly. that. Exactly. So, you know, there is a history aspect to the history and haunts uh, event. Uh, 1903, the home was built by uh, who many consider the father of Oklahoma City, Henry Overholzer and his wife, Anna. They built this palace on the prairie that is uh, about 90% intact with their original furnishings. Even their clothes still hang in the closet. So it's an opportunity to learn about the uh, wonderful family that helped build Oklahoma City and this wonderful home that the only one family ever lived in. And I know this is such a popular event. I mean, what can you say is it that keeps bringing people out? I think the opportunity to become, uh, for one night, maybe even one night only, a paranormal investigator. We encourage our yeah. guests to uh, bring any equipment. iPhone is the perfect paranormal investigate piece of equipment for paranormal investigation. Uh, and then we also have our friends Walt and Carrie, who are uh, paranormal investigators here in Oklahoma City. Uh, they work with us throughout the year. They will be on site sharing um, evidence that they have uh, accrued over the year. So, perfect. Yeah event for uh, October. We got Halloween spooky season coming up. Okay. And it is, Kylie, it is not a scary event. Not. I mean, it's family friendly mm -hmm. 100%. So. All right. Yeah. We have tickets going on sale at noon, noon today. today. Where yes. can we tell people to go get those uh, tickets? Overholstermansion.org and you will see a button that says uh, History and Haunts and we'll take you to the ticket link there. All right. We'll get that link from him and we'll put up on the As Seen On section of KOCO.com. We have more information and details up there right now.